Hey everybody, it's time for some more Beyonce. We are going to do the Super Bowl reaction, which we promised we would do. We do have a lot of new people who are joining us, and so we're kind of excited to get this get this rolling, Ryan. Thanks to everyone who has watched our journey up to the Super Bowl, and maybe someone's watching this who hasn't seen our journey. So go check out the Beyonce playlist. You can actually watch our journey in real time as we did the set list in order of her performance here of the Super Bowl. So you get to see kind of our journey with those songs. I re highly recommend it. Mm -hmm. To those who have watched it and have been very kind to us, Nathan, I think we're actually, knock on wood, I'm not even joking, I think we're at 100% likes. I think we're at a perfect score. Now, someone's going to downvote this video just to spite us. That's just fine. because. They're like, just oh, because. Well, I'll go back and find all their other ones and downvote <laughs> <Yeah>. those ones. <laughs> we did get some comments, though, when we announced that we're doing Beyonce, some of our subscribers. I will not be joining you on this journey. <laughs> and I'm like, okay. okay. <laughs> Don't let the door hit you. Okay. Yeah, I'm excited. Let's go. So this is 2013 Beyonce's uh, Super Bowl performance. Excellence must be pursued. It must be wooed with all of one's might and every bit of effort that we have. And each day, the new encounter. Woo! Each Fire. week, yeah, the new challenge. All of the noise, oh. all of the glamour, all of the color, all of the excitement. All of the the and all of the money. Yeah. These are the things that really linger only in the memory. But the spirit, the will to excel, the will to win, these are the things that are sure, 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 sure. Baby, it's you. You're the one alive. I love. Mm -hmm. You're the only one I see. <laughs> baby, baby, it's you. Come on, baby, it's you. Come on, baby, it's you. When I need you, baby, everything stops. Yeah. Super dog. One, two, three, four. Let's get it. Okay, already on the Okay. That was very quick. Uh, yeah. I should have had the set list in front of me. Sorry about that. Just give me one. This is 2013, right? Yes, 2013. So, Nathan, that first little part there, that was the Love on Top song. And it does say here it was a cappella. That was it. That was just a quick little intro. Fair enough. But I'm so glad we got to hear the whole song. What are your yeah, thoughts, yeah. though, on our opening singing notes? What do you think? It's clearly live. Like, it's not, this isn't, you know, her just lip syncing along with you know a pre-recorded track or anything it's, it's definitely her off the cuff doing these montage there must have been a ton of rehearsal that went into this i think she just woke up that day and <laughs> like, you know what let's start with this song uh, and then after that <laughs> yes i suspect there was hundreds of hours of rehearsal but oh yeah, yeah. no i'm saying <laughs> okay me likey stage look good okay so this is our real first live like we saw that other video live oh, i forget the name of it already the one the world beat drum song but it was kind of like a montage of live different performances montage together yeah so this is our first real like one camera so, or one shot live vocal she sounds fantastic this is a great live performance okay now we're going into the next song nathan baby, baby, it's you. crazy in love on, baby. Oh, 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 oh. 
Almost got a wardrobe malfunction on this pause here. <laughs> <laughs> Holy smokes. That's some good timing there. Yeah, it's great timing. She, uh, she's got those things glued on tighter than uh, your dentures, I'll tell you. Okay. Um, <laughs> the stage is incredible. This is. Oh, yeah. But she's got money behind her, right? She must have money behind her. Like This is a huge production for a 13 minute mm. performance. The lights mm. underneath the stage. Yeah, this is a fantastic screen production. The dancers, and yeah, I got excited just watching her dance. I can see why this live stuff because it's just she gets the energetic. You know, you just want to move with her. It's it's fun, mm -hmm. absolutely. Dancing is intoxicating. Like she's just got such a great what? No, I was just saying I don't want to unpause this. That's all. <laughs> That's. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, yay. Okay, sorry, Nathan. I apologize. Go you, ahead. You can go back and pause it wherever you want. Oh, stop it. <laughs> what were you going to say? I I uh, stepped on you. What were you going to say? Me like dancing. Oh, right. Let's keep going. <laughs> okay, so the next song is End of Time, then Baby Boy. Okay, here we go. Mm -hmm. Give it up. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, it's still going. Okay, it's still going. Okay, here we go. Look at that. Cool. Oh, I'm sorry, it's still going my fault. Sorry, now they stop. Yeah, of course. So that guitar was real. There was no yeah, she was, overdubbed or anything like that. And then playing. the drums are real too, because it, it sounds like a more natural drum beat rather than a, a pre-recorded track. Right. So there's someone playing drums there. I, I don't know if they ever cut to them, but yeah, yeah. Now, that might be her her guitarist. My understanding is from some of the comics. She does have her own band. I think a lot of them are female, so that's really cool. I, I love it. It's a show. It's a production. It's Mm -hmm. It's a spectacle in a good way. I mean, they got the sparks come out. It's old school. This is stuff they would do in the 80s, you know, fire yeah, coming out of the guitars yeah. and things like that. Like, I love that kind of stuff. It's fantastic. Everything you can throw in it to the song she's doing. We're sorry, folks, for pausing at the wrong time. We don't know exactly when the medley stopped because she started talking. But OK, I think mm -hmm. the next song will kick in now. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, this is the, the drum one. Oh, the bass player. Look at that. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. And they're playing. They're playing. You're right. Oh, there's the drum kit right there. So. Okay. Shake that booty -less. I really like this song. Love you like crazy. Now say you'll never let me go. Baby, come on, get up on it. Show me that you really want it. I want to be the one I love you, baby. Let's go. Oh, baby, let's go. I want to provide this loving that you're giving. I ain't running in this love. Can you let me love you from your head to toe? Oh, baby, let's go. Everybody, put your hands together. Drummer. I love it. There she is. Yeah.
I just wanted that to go longer. Oh, I know. It's <laughs> you know, it's a halftime show. They can only it's not a full concert here, but no. What a great way to kind of like, hey, you're getting the hits real quick. It's a full on show that probably costs millions and millions of dollars to put on. You're getting basically a mini concert out of it, which you are. I've seen some artists in the halftime show lip sync. Now, maybe people said, oh, it's because of the sound or the, I don't know. I've heard different things, different excuses. She's singing. Mm -hmm. Like Mm -hmm. she's singing. You can hear the cardio in her voice. That's fantastic. Mm -hmm. I love it. I don't want to hear a studio voice. I want to hear you breathing. I want to hear the, not the struggle, but the strain. Cause you're, she's doing aerobics and dancing and she's singing. Yeah. And that's what I want to hear. I want to hear you breathe, yeah. sister. This is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> she can breathe in my yeah, ear yeah. anytime she wants. Okay. Um, I don't know. She just looks great. She looks great. Would you put that down? Stop it. <laughs> Oh, cool effect. Look at that. Oh, wow. This is fake. There's not that many Beyonce's on stage. <laughs> fake there's news. Only one, there's only the, one Beyonce. This is fake. This is a hologram. <laughs> Wow, that's very clever. This is green work. I think about you all the time. Summer screens come up. Let's see what's going down. Oh, wow. That's it. (laughs) Okay. It must be starting another song now. Yeah. This is such an impressive. Like, you could watch it with the sound off. (laughs) <laughs> the, yeah. the visuals are great. I've never seen anything like this before for a halftime show or for any. I don't want to keep comparing to other artists. So I don't want to bring up any other artists' names. So I'm just saying we've seen some other concerts of other artists that we've reacted to. And this is putting a lot of productions years later that are new shows to shame. This is a high end production. Like the, the she stands mm-hmm. in the middle, these holograms, real dancers, and the, the effects behind her are timed perfectly. She has to be on key because that's a mm-hmm. playback video. The she has mm-hmm. to be synchronized with it. So then I've got a question f- for the beehive. I want to know if in a concert, is it the same level of intensity or more? She puts on a concert. Is it kind of like this? But she'd have to pace herself to do I suspect there's a little bit more. Oh, yeah, yeah. I don't mean like a, I don't mean oh. like a medley like this. When I mean, she did that last song, that song, is that kind of like a snippet from what she would do live or any of these other songs? Is that what you would see at a live show? That's all I'm asking. So I misunderstood your first question. So you're saying, does she do the full version of this type of thing at the show? Are we seeing like mm-hmm. examples mm-hmm. of the show? Okay. Are these like slices from the concert? Yeah, yeah. So some are saying same or more. We might be getting different stuff for the actual Super Bowl show, which I would suspect too. But you're right. At the tour for this time that she might have been on tour, these are kind of some of the tricks that she might have done. So people are saying yes. Mm-hmm. So great question, Nathan. <laughs> Oh, this is, uh, I think this is, I think that's the Destiny Girls. Is that Destiny's Child? Is it, are these girls from Destiny's Child? Well, I think it's Destiny's Children. Yeah. Um, yeah. Because the next songs are their names. I'm sorry. No, I like (laughs) it's Destiny One, it's Thing One and Thing Two. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) I don't know their names either. I'm sorry. I'm sure they're doing great. I'm sure they're very happy to be here right now. We're doing Bootylicious than Independent Woman, so that must be the Destiny Child coming in mm. here. Okay. Okay. Great. I don't think you can Do 
you'd be more booty? That'd be more booty list than that. Question, tell me what you think about me. I buy my own diamonds and I buy my own ring. Don't let me go tell it when I'm feeling lonely. Maybe not. Talk local, please get up and leave. Question, shoes on my feet. I thought it was my wearing. Very short, booty whispers. She's like, get off my stage. <laughs> <laughs> I've got to say, the other two Destiny's children mm-hmm. look great. They, they look great. Look, they, 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 like, they've taken great care shape. Themselves. They're like, yeah. able to pull that off just like that. Great harmonies, really. That's what I really wanted to mention. Is I'm, I'm really impressed with the, the quality of the harmony. And, and of course, it's Beyonce who's pulling off her harmonies amidst... Mm-hmm having just done like five songs already. So they all sound, yeah, they sound really great together. Well, they sounded great together and it's nice to see them out there uh, with uh, Beyonce. And I don't know what their story is. This recording, just so people know if they're watching this on YouTube or watching this live now, we asked the question, <clears throat> which has not been answered yet because the video's not on YouTube yet. Basically, why did Beyonce go solo? Mm-hmm. That's the big question. So she was in this group, Destiny's Child. They had four or five albums together, a pretty mm-hmm. successful group, girl group. Yep. Beyonce went solo in her early 20s. I wonder why. And what happened to these two gals? Did they have solo careers that are su- successful? Or and maybe we know their stuff? I don't know. Hmm. All right. So let us know in the comments, or you can let us know in the live chat, too. That'd be fine. Okay. Here we go. Mm-hmm. Oh, these are Charlie Angel. Look at that. Mm-hmm. Bang, bang. Everybody put your hands together. Like this. Hey, hey. Michelle, can y'all help me sing this one? Show no, baby. I'm a single lady. I'm oh, we're gonna sing with her. Okay, lady. that's cool. I'm a single that's lady. Cool. I'm, first. I'm a single lady. Up in the club, we just broke up. I'm doing my own little thing, saying Kelly. Yeah. Same Michelle. I want y'all to give it up for the lovely Kevin Michelle. This is what I picture heaven. (laughs) (laughs) You get through the pearly gates and you just see a (laughs) hundred gals with legs up to their necks waiting for you. (laughs) Doing the single lady stance. Welcome, Ryan. We've been waiting for you. Behold. Yeah. <laughs> Cue the music. All the single ladies. All the single ladies. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Put Ryan on it. Okay. Um. I think it's kind of cool that she involved them. And I think having them on stage and the, her cooperation with them here, I think it's telling some of the story that we don't know already. We've asked the question, you know, what happened, but it doesn't look like it was like an angry falling out or a I'm out of here kind of thing. I think it's no, I would guess that it ended amicably. That's so, a good word. Thank just, you for saying yeah, that. Based on the way that they seem to be interacting with her and they get it. She's the star. I'm impressed with the overall performance, obviously so far impressed mm-hmm. how they, how well they work with her. Kind of cool to see them help her out with that song, which is like her big hit, right? This is the one that mm-hmm. catapulted her. I would say her career. Yeah. I've heard that so many times at weddings. So Mm. 
Yeah, so that was a fun performance. Of course, the dancing, the gals, everyone dancing with her. Nice touch, like you said, having the the Destiny Childs with her. Is it Beyonce's one of her nicknames, Sasha Fierce? Have you heard that before? Yeah, I think she had a nickname or something. You know, David Bowie had different names. Ziggy Stardust, for example. Oh, okay. Like different characters. I think Beyonce did that too. Like she became a character. I could be wrong. Oh, you're still going. Okay. Who's this doing her at calisthenics? <laughs> yes. What am I bringing in? Everybody put your hands up like this. What am I singing lady What am I bringing in? Oh, there you go. There's the ending. Okay. Mm-hmm. Look at that smile. Boy, she's got a great smile. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, she can dance. She can perform. Looks like she's just doing her calisthenics for the day. <laughs> like, I'm just going to do my <laughs> exercises. Like, remember those uh, 1980s, like uh, Richard Simmons exercises? You know? <laughs> yes, yes, I do. Although you seem to remember more about it than I do. I just, I remember that they exist, but. Do you know like intimate details about? Yes, I love Richard Simmons. Thank you. Everybody, put your hands towards me. Everybody, I'm gonna feel your energy. Ooh. Wave your hands with me. Come on. When those walls are built, baby, they tumble down. Didn't even put up a fight. They didn't even make the sound. I found a way to let you in, but I never really had a doubt. Standing in the light of your halo, I got my angel now. You might have been awakened. Every rule I had to break it. It's the risk that I'm taking. I ain't never gonna shut you out. when she said to everybody let me see your hands put your hands out put them out in front of me wave to me it like forces them to put their phones down right that was kind of a Mm. cool clever trick to do because i mean it must get frustrating for a lot of artists especially like artists around our age where like the entire crowd is sitting there holding their phone up trying to record the thing and not just engaging in the moment instead of saying hey everybody put your phones away it's a wait just let me see your hands let me see your hands right they all put their hands up. ironically of course the one fan that is like right in front of her <laughs> at the end that pulls his phone out <laughs> it's recording oh, her anyways i missed that yeah. okay yeah, yeah. well gee i wonder <laughs> i wonder if they'll show this on tv later <laughs> you 
right? I wonder if it'll be better than my phone. What a song, what an ending, what a performance. She gave it her all at that end. Uh, she she knew it. You could tell that she nailed this. There's so much work that goes into this thing, man. I don't know what halftime show, I would say top is the right word, because the production alone, that was a real band playing with her. She did it all. The things that I would yeah. maybe look to criticize, I couldn't find anything. Mm. it's an a-plus performance nathan i mean that the only criticism is too short i wanted to see a whole concert right just a fantastic show I, if i was in that crowd i would be so go buy a lottery ticket i must be the most luckiest person in the world to be this close to beyonce yeah that, that's kind of the the feeling i got because that's what these cameras allow is us to to interact and to feel like we got to be there with them too but I'm really loving this journey. Yeah, it's fresh. It's a fresh artist for our channel. So it's helping us to feel re reinvigorated, exploring a artist's journey. And it's really cool because she has 20 plus years of catalog and journey and concerts and performances and award ceremonies. So there's a lot out there to glean from and to react to. Awesome. I love Halo. It's a good song. I've never heard it before till the reaction we did. And now the Super Bowl performance. She can sing alive. Nathan, she can sing live the rumors are true she sings live some artists don't but she do yeah i'm speechless i i feel kind of yeah lucky that a i got to do this with my best friend and watch this we're completely clueless we're two completely clueless white guys that grew up in canada listening to metal and here we are listening to beyonce i never would have thought in a million years that i would have a enjoyed it as much as I do, and B been wanting to hear more. So mm -hmm. that's a good sign. Yeah. yeah. Thank you so much, everyone who watched this. More to come. Thank you, everybody. And we will see you on the next one.